Tenley Town, located in Upper Northwest, is often called Washington, D.C.'s second oldest village. In 1791, a survey recorded John Tenali's Tavern, where River Road crossed the route of today's Wisconsin Avenue. Under the leadership of Jane Waldman and Carolyn Long, the Tenley Town Historical Society has preserved the many layers of this neighborhood's history. The real impetus for the nominations was the uh, survey we did of Tenley Town buildings in 2003, and that produced a list of sites that were good candidates for listing. And we looked at the list and said, okay, this is a good thing to do. The Tenley Town Historical Society has prepared successful landmark nominations for over a dozen neighborhood buildings including the Jesse Reno School, the Methodist Cemetery, and the North Webster Chappelle House. Jane and I and, and our other THS board members have, have figured out which of the old buildings that are left need to be landmarked, and we've done it. I, I don't, we have very seldom had one of our nominations turned down by the Historic Preservation Review review board. The society secures landmark designation through research, careful evaluation, and consultation with owners and community stakeholders. Jane and Carolyn have had a really con consequential impact on uh, the Tenley Town neighborhood and preservation and sort of recognition of the history of Tenley Town. If you look at a, a map of our historic neighborhoods, Tenley Town probably has the most landmarks designated than any other area in the city. Tenley Town's African-American community has a long and rich heritage. In 2015, the Historical Society oversaw the creation of an exhibit on the history of Reno City, a post-Civil War African-American community and the Reno School that served it. The exhibit was installed in the landmark Reno School building on the Deal Middle School grounds. In 2010, the Tenley Town Historical Society worked with the D.C. Cultural Tourism, the Tenley Town Neighbors Association, and others to create the Tenley Town Heritage Trail. To create a heritage trail required some neighborhood leaders uh, to organize the neighborhood. It was their job to show us at Cultural Tourism D.C. that the neighborhood wanted this heritage trail. Uh, and Jane and Carolyn were just terrific at doing that job. So uh, not only were they great at organizing the neighborhood, but they knew the history themselves. This self-guided walking tour features a path of 19 signs outlining neighborhood history. The Historical Society regularly leads walking tours for the public and offers numerous programs for its members and community residents. I think they, they have helped the neighborhood grow very vibrantly while preserving the beauty of our homes, our landscape, our, our green space. In 2020, Carolyn, an artist and author, published an extensive history of the Tenley Town neighborhood, Armsley Park, on its centennial. I know that they do so much that I don't even think about. And when I talked to Jane about it, she said, she just does things. She doesn't keep track of what, what she did. She just does them. So it's hard It's hard to, to reach back and remember all the wonderful things they've done, but they have done a lot of wonderful things. Jane and Carolyn's devotion to preserving the history of Tenley Town has profoundly benefited the neighborhood. Their perseverance, volunteer leadership, and community outreach have preserved not just Tenley Town's history, but a sense of place, leaving the city as well as the community richer.